वेलकम बैक टू कैड कैम ट्यूटोरियल टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्केच अ बटरफ्लाई वॉल इन सॉलिड वर्क्स दिस इज द बॉडी ऑफ बटरफ्लाई वॉल एंड दिस इज द टू डी डायमेंशन सो जस्ट नोट इट डाउन एंड वी आर गोइंग टू स्केच अ बॉडी इन सॉलिड वर्क्स सो लेट्स सी हाउ टू स्केच इन सॉलिड वर्क्स सेलेक्ट फ्रंट प्लेन चूज टॉप प्लेन स्केच नो सेलेक्ट सर्कल एंड रो थ्री स्मॉल थ्री सर्कल्स वन टू थ्री असाइन डायमीटर थ्री फिफ्टी वन नाइंटी फोर टू एटी ओके आउटर डायमीटर सेलेक्ट फॉर कंस्ट्रक्शन जोमेट्री सेलेक्ट सर्कल एंड ड्रॉ वन सर्कल एंड ड्रॉ वन मोर बिग सर्कल नाउ असाइन डायमीटर फोर्टी सेवन एम एम इन साइड एंड हंड्रेड एम एम आउटसाइड choose a line and from this point draw one choose a line and draw from up to this line again choose a line draw from up to this line choose trim entities and trim unnecessary parts select okay now choose circular pat sketch pattern select this as a center point select this geometry and keep three numbers we want three numbers of geometry so click okay again choose trim entities and select this unnecessary portion okay now go to feature select extruded boss select the body select 32 mm upward okay now select top body sketch normal choose circle and draw two circle just parallel to this and parallel to outer select extruded boss select 80.5 okay now select this surface choose mirror select bodies and select the main body now we are going to make a mirror of half part okay so now our body is ready choose front plane plain 160 mm okay now select this plain sketch normal choose one center line and draw one center line from midpoint okay now select circle and draw one circle from midpoint assign diameter 200 mm okay now go to feature select extruded boss
select up to surface and select this body ok now select this plane sketch normal choose circle ok assign diameter hundred mm go to feature select extruded cut and make depth up to 22.5 mm ok now select inside sketch normal choose circle draw one circle from midpoint and assign diameter 56.2 and select extruded cut and just extend it up to outside ok now select this surface sketch normal choose the circle and draw one circle from midpoint and select this circle for construction here ok now assign diameter 150 mm select circle draw one small circle and assign 20 mm select sketch pattern select the circle and choose this as a midpoint center hole and keep three numbers ok go to feature select extruded cut cut up to 20 mm depth sorry select extruded cut up to 20 mm inside ok see the holes are created now hide this plane select front plane go to reference geometry plane 175 mm flip side ok now select this plane sketch normal choose circle draw one circle from center point assign diameter 75 mm ok go to select extruded boss and here choose up to surface select the surface ok now select this inside surface sketch normal choose circle and draw one circle from origin center point up to this same circle ok select extruded cut up to 285 mm ok now hide this plane select shape and see and see the whole see it is cut up to see this is whole it, it is cut it is showing the section view cancel it now assign the color we will assign color
this is gutter go to appearance choose solid select orange but light orange okay now save this part part 1 body i will save temporary on desktop later i will see now let's see our uh, next part this is the body of butterfly wall now this is second part arm for butterfly wall we are going to sketch so just note down the dimension of arm so let's see how to sketch in solid works so now we are going to sketch arm for butterfly wall so choose top plane sketch now select circle and draw two circles now the same in parallelly draw two more circles now assign diameter 112.5 56.3 and this outer diameter 87.5 mm 43.8 mm and distance 300 mm okay now select origin point and this circle midpoint make horizontal go to feature select extruded boss extrude up to 62.5 mm and choose mid plane okay now select top plane sketch normal choose a line and draw two tangent line okay again draw one line okay now make sure these lines are tangent okay now select this outer circle both outer circle click convert entities okay choose trim and trim outside portion now go to feature select extruded boss select this choose mid plane select thickness 25 mm okay now see it is created the arm body is almost created this is arm body for butterfly wall now select this surface is sketch normal choose circle and draw two circles assign diameter 152.5 mm 127.5 mm okay now select this line choose offset entities make reverse 25 mm the same this also uncheck okay now again choose offset now select this line 25 mm okay choose trimming tool and 
रिमूव अननेसेसरी पार्ट ओके गो टू फीचर सेलेक्ट एक्सक्लूडेड कट चूज डेप्थ फाइव एम एम ओके नाउ सेलेक्ट टॉप प्लेन चूज मेरर and select this cutout okay now it is ready choose fillet 5 mm choose outside radius okay now select this top surface is sketch normal choose corner rectangle and draw from up again choose corner rectangle okay up to here assign 6.3 पॉइंट थ्री एम एम ओके सेलेक्ट थ्री कॉर्नर्स मेरर ओके सेंटर वन सेलेक्ट एंड चूज फॉर कंस्ट्रक्शन नाउ वी वॉन्ट टू एक्सटेंड इट necessary line deleted this also select construction line select this diameter length 7.7 mm okay go to feature select extruded cut and choose here through all select okay see it is cut through all now assign material select green okay now this is arm for butterfly wall save it part 2 arm thanks for watching now next we will see next part now we are going to sketch a shaft for butterfly wall this is the shaft for butterfly wall and this is 2d dimension so let's see how to sketch in solid works it is very easy and simple now we are going to make a shaft so start choose right plane sketch select circle draw one circle from origin point assign diameter 36.5 mm select extruded boss 28.9 mm okay now go to insert select annotation and choose cosmetic thread we want to insert a thread cosmetic thread not real thread so just select the edge okay edit okay now it's showing the depth now select this plane sketch normal choose circle draw one circle assign diameter 56 mm select extruded boss and choose 89.8 mm length 
ओके नाउ द सेम एज सेलेक्ट दिस एंड स्केच नॉर्मल चूज सर्कल सेलेक्ट डायमीटर 87.2 mm extrude the body up to 24 mm okay now again select this surface a sketch normal choose circle and draw one circle and assign diameter 56 mm and extrude extrude the circle Two hundred forty-seven point one mm. Okay. Now see. Now select front plane, sketch, normal. Choose corner rectangle and draw one corner rectangle. Assign distance. Thirty-eight point two mm, thirty-one point one mm, and distance from here to here fifteen point one mm. Okay, go to feature, select extruded cut, choose mid plane, select okay. Now select this surface, sketch, normal. Choose one center line and draw one, one center line. Okay, and again choose and draw one line from midpoint. Now select circle and draw two small circles. Now assign diameter. 12 mm and distance from here to this line keep 50 mm okay go to feature select extruded cut and make depth only 1.25 mm this much depth we want only okay so now our shaft is ready we will assign some color to this shaft or assign some blue color okay this is our shaft so let's see our next part first save it three point shaft butterfly wall okay now we are going to make another part this is called plate for butterfly wall this is the 2d dimension in the thickness is 25 mm so let's see how to sketch in solid works now we are going to make a plate for uh, butterfly wall so choose front plane a sketch select circle and draw two circles one and two assign diameter the bigger one keep 200 mm and the smaller one 56 mm select one center line and draw one vertical line and keep Length seventy five mm. Select circle and draw one circle at the end point and choose diameter twenty mm. Select circular sketch pattern. We want three number of holes, so keep three numbers of circle. Okay. Now go to feature select extruded boss. 
thickness keep 25 mm this is what we want okay so now assign the color let's say green okay this is our plate for sterling for butterfly wall save it part number 4 plate now we are going to sketch plate 2 for butterfly wall this is the plate which we will use inside the butterfly wall so let's see how to sketch in solid works this is the 2d dimensions now we are going to make is plate 2 so select front plane is sketch choose center line okay again choose center line and draw on vertical line now assign dimension 96.9 mm One hundred two point five mm. Choose tangent arc. Draw one tangent up to here. Okay. Now choose mirror entity. Select this. Okay. Now again choose mirror entity. Select this line. Mirror about this line. Okay. Now choose circle and draw one twelve mm circle. And distance from here to origin point fifteen mm, fifty mm. Make sure the center point and origin point in same plane. Now mirror entity select this circle. mirror about just mirror this circle okay now go to extruded cut extruded body select 6 mm we want 6 mm thickness click okay so now our plate 2 is ready this is our plate 2 for vertical sterling engine okay This is our plate too. So save it as a plate too. Now, Now let's we see are going to part. sketch a bolt for butterfly wall. This is the bolt for butterfly wall. So let's see how to sketch in solid works. It is simple. Now we want to sketch a bolt so select top plane is sketch select circle and draw one circle from origin point keep diameter 18.5 mm extruded boss keep length 38 mm okay now choose chamfer select 2 mm chamfer and select this bottom 1 mm okay it is chamfered now select front plane is sketch normal select a line and draw a line from here to here again choose a line draw one vertical line now assign dimension 10 mm 14.2 mm now select 3 point r okay assign radius 15 mm okay go to feature select revolve and choose this line 
okay now bold head is created see this is the head of bold so again choose front plane sketch normal choose one center line draw one vertical line assign this length 3 mm select corner rect center rect corner rectangle and assign this 2 mm okay now select this rectangle mirror and choose mirror about this line okay center line select and make construction line go to feature select reward extruded cut choose mid plane select okay now our bolt is ready this is our bolt for butterfly wall we will see how to use in assembly so now we finished all six parts now we are going to start a assembly of butterfly wall so let's see how to do assembly in but solid works welcome back to cad cam tutorial now we are going to start assembly of butterfly wall so let's see select new choose assembly okay just drag it now browse the part butterfly wall choose files first uh, select shaft again insert component select plate 2 now move the component okay now choose mat select this hole and select this hole okay the same as here select this hole and select this hole okay select this surface select back side okay now insert body body now choose mat select this outer portion of shaft and this inside portion of wall select this body and make fix so that body will not move shaft select float select this and choose mat and select this hole okay now we will insert another component we will choose plate okay now select this shaft mat and choose this hole okay now select this hole and this hole okay now choose the body and the back side of this plate okay this is fixed now we will insert bolt select this outer body mat and choose the back side of head okay 
now select this hole and select this bolt okay now we want to copy this bolt in three holes now just press control and copy this bolt again press control and copy one more select this bolt mat hole okay drag it out select the surface and back side of bolt okay again press control and drag out one bolt select this surface mat select this okay now select hole and select bolt now all the three bolts fixed with this now we will assemble arms insert arm open keep here select this inside hole mat and choose this okay now select okay now we created one relation initially we will delete this relation now we will adjust our shaft okay delete this relation now move it back our shaft okay now select shaft mat and choose this inside hole okay so now it is perfectly joined with this now select this outer face and select this outer face okay okay go to here choose nut we want to select choose nc inch here choose nut in nut choose hexagon nut and hexagon thick nut we want and choose the things select one and one and half by six inch okay now fix with this body okay this extra bolt deleted now see our butterfly valve is ready just change the plane now this valve ready we will assign some relation choose section view select this inside hole mat and choose this click distance distance is 33.117 this okay okay now exit from section view now select this plate mat and choose this handle keep parallel okay now see our butterfly valve is ready now see how it works just rotate it see our butterfly valve rotating this is our simple butterfly valve we 
we are going to rotate butterfly wall see so please subscribe our channel for more videos and more projects in solidworks thanks for watching